Lives on the line. San Antonio and the Bear County metro area once again facing a serious blood shortage. Today, Mayor Ron Nuremberg declaring it an emergency. Yeah, and the pandemic is only making things harder. Our Jonathan Coto shows us why blood banks and hospitals are more desperate than ever for your donations. With San Antonio facing a blood crisis, people lined up today to help. Hundreds donating to fight the critical shortage. More than 1,000 1, drives were canceled last year. And that trend is continuing as the Omicron surge sweeps through our community and our region. Today, the South Texas Blood and Tissue Center mobilizing their efforts to increase their critically low blood supply. We've had plenty of people that scheduled an appointment, so they're all coming out as well as a lot of walk-ins. Strong winds and chilly temperatures not keeping these folks from stepping in to help. There's a need right now, and if we can help, this is a really good way to help people. For some, donating blood is something they've always done. You know, there's always the need, you know, and... Uh, uh, one day we may need it for ourselves, so you know, it's kind of pay it forward type of thing. And for others, it's the critical need for blood that led them to donate for the first time. Our community need, needs the blood right now, and we're both first-time donors, and we thought we'd come out here together and and do it for the first time. City officials say unlike previous shortages, there is nowhere to turn for additional blood. Our community has a two-day supply of all blood types, and blood type O is at less than a day. I'm about to find out. I hope it is the type that they need because I know they are in, in need of a certain type. And if you're interested in donating blood and weren't able to make it out today, there are still ways you can participate. For more information, head on over to KSAT.com. Reporting, Jonathan Cotto, KSAT 12 News.